All these words from my mouth can never really capture what I want to say. It's hard enough trying to say something, but to phrase it just right? Impossible. I spent so long trying to be perfect and immaculate, but as I sat there trying to get the words to come out, I realized I was going about it the wrong way. As I sat there, content that my brother was finally home after months of being away, and just happy to have Christmas around the corner and to be on break, I realized that's what I should be striving for. Simple happiness, simple words. What I've learned, though, is that happiness is a myth. It's the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow if you could ever find it. And that's just it, isn't it? There isn't an end because it doesn't exist, and the same holds true for our lives. We're cogs in a machine, and when we think we're done, we're not. We sacrifice our children to continue for us. With each generation, the climb gets higher and harder to scale. The new standards to appeal to, and we'll do anything to get there. And when we reach them, we're ready to the next thing. We aren't allowed to save our small victories, because if we do, we'll miss the chance to do something greater. It was an offhanded comment that made me take a step back. My friend had simply said that if you thought about it, Dogs lead a sad life. They only get to see and know as much as they let them to. To which I replied, at least they were happy. They were okay with small things like treats and walks, unlike humans who require so much more. And it got me thinking, why can't we just be like dogs? To live in the moment and savor the present. But I guess that's a talent we discarded saying it's useless. The future is the only important thing. And if you don't worry about it, you'll fall behind. And I'm tired of it. I'm tired of being in a competition I didn't sign up for. I don't want to feel inadequate anymore. I wish to be enough, but no matter what my parents, teachers, friends say, I know that I'm not. Because society says so. I have to keep climbing. I have to be better. But I just want to feel content. Just one more time. To feel like I did during winter break for one more second, pleased with my choices and not worried about the ones I'll make later. But at the end of the day, a break is only a break, and the world is still the same. And in this never-ending race to be the best at everything, we focus only on the path in front of us and refuse to even consider the ones next to us. Because we, if we do, it means death. Individuality means death. But I want to throw away all my masks and be unabashedly me. I want to cut the strings that tie me to this stupid, complicated life and be free of the intricacies that make my life harder. I want to choose another trail. I want to run backwards and find the ones I left behind. And together, we will find that pot of gold because rainbows do end somewhere and so does this race. And we will find that finish line and cross it together. And that day may not be today, but one day we'll get there together.